Ken, lovely to meet you. I wanted to first ask you about this interview you gave last month. Um, you've scored two goals, you've played against West Brom, and the interview you gave had an enormous reaction. I'm, I'm happy with the goals, I'm happy with the win today as well. It wasn't uh, uh, a must win here at home. You spoke so... with the stammer, and some people hadn't heard that before. Were you surprised by the reaction? Actually, yeah, I was. Uh, I didn't th th think think like this, you know. Uh, obviously, I had a good game. Yeah, he had like a hat on target on the keeper, and then I was just there, you know. Uh, and he just was like right on my foot, and I just uh, smashed it onto the goal. For the video to become to become so big, <laughs> it was amazing because it was so much love, so much like real reactions, and I heard so many big names of it, like role model, inspirational. Uh, I've, I've, I've helped so many kids and adults who maybe also has a stammer. Have you always had a stammer? It maybe started so, so when, I, when I was six, six years old. Uh, but I didn't knew so how it came, you know. I, I didn't know anything, it just come. Um, that became eight, ten, I just, I just f f f felt like it's normal, it's like a part of me. Obviously, I had some days, I was a little bit more n nervous, I like, can I, oh, okay, so I have to go in front of the class, and, but I still did, 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 did it, you know what I mean, like, it never affect me in like a way that I can't do it. Here's Seema. He's very strong, bringing that forward. I uh, always had this dream to like uh, become a footballer. Mm, a little trick there as well. I didn't see this as an issue. Some people with stammers, they say that they avoid certain words or they try and hide it. Yeah. Do you have that issue? Um, I, not really. I'm trying to say everything I think. It doesn't find me as a person, you know, like, okay, this is Kawira Stammer. I, I, don't, I don't see it that way. And I'm curious because you're Swedish, yeah. so English is not your first language. Does that affect your stammer? Yeah, you're getting you, 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 you used to it, you know. I'm getting used to it. I've been here a long time. Uh, I've been here five years. I learned English in school. So, like, I don't feel like it's hard for me. So, like, to speak English and, and have a stammer. There have been quite a few famous people who have stammers. Joe Biden, for example, the US president, he's spoken about his. This isn't about, there's a reason why he's bringing up all this malarkey. I learned so much from having to deal with stuttering. It gave me insight into other people's pain. How important is it, do you think, that people such as yourself talk about it and are open about it? No, I think is it is actually it is because if I if I told myself also like as a a young kid like ten years old at TV I watch TV I watch like oh is a, f a footballer has a stammer I would feel like wow amazing because he's like me you know if he can do it I can do it. Sema, Sema with the spin. And you've become a role model for many people because of the interview yeah, and because yeah, of talking yeah, about this. How, yeah, how important is that for you? I didn't expect that really, but um, I'm happy about it. Thankful about every comment, thankful about everything. And uh, if I can help, I'm here to help.